So we are on day six of Vlogmas. And today I wanted to share with you guys some of our family ornaments. Every year we get Munchkin a new ornament that sort of encompasses kind of like what she's accomplished through the year, anything that she's really into that year. So I'm just going to take you through a couple of our ornaments that we have and why they're special to us. Here is Munchkin's first ornament, 2008 Baby's First Christmas. Her entire bedroom was decorated with the Pooh, and so we decided to get her a baby's first ornament in the same theme. 2009, she was obsessed with Thomas the Tank Engine, and we went to pick out the ornament. She wanted Percy instead of Thomas, and so that's what she got. 2010 got us this purple Ravens football ornament here. It does have a little bit of damage at the top, but that just means it's well worth 2011 brings us to the Rocky Horror Picture Show ornament. This was the first time my daughter got to watch the Rocky Horror Picture Show. She, of course, had been listening to the soundtrack since the day she was born, much like I have. In 2012, we were at a craft show in August, and she decided she wanted to go ahead and get the Triforce ornament she had seen on someone's table because she loved watching my brother play Zelda on the Wii, and that's what she wanted, so that's what we got. 2013 brought her a love of Merida. The two of them share very curly, kinky kind of hair. And this is the only Disney princess ornament we have on our tree, excluding one that I was given when I was a child, which is the Little Mermaid. In 2014, my daughter was all about emojis. She was crazy about them. She still is. It's been an obsession of hers for a couple years now. It's not really an ornament. It's actually a keychain clip, but she loves it so much that she wanted to make it an ornament. Fun fact, this was actually a toy she got in one of her McDonald's Happy Meals. So, ornaments come from all over. In 2015, she had a complete obsession with Minecraft, so same thing, it's actually a keychain, but it's an end, or it's a nether portal, not an end portal, it's a nether portal. I could not find a Minecraft ornament to save my life. I was actually entertained the idea of making one for her, but I saw this at Target and I just grabbed it. In 2016, we took her to see Star Wars in theaters and she decided that this is going to be her 2016 ornament. So we haven't picked out her 2017 ornament yet. I don't know when we will. I thought we would do it this weekend, but she's going to see my mom for the weekend. And then I thought maybe we would do it next weekend, but I'm going to be going on a trip next weekend, the weekend after this weekend, two weeks. I'm going on a trip in two weeks. So we will find time to get her her ornament. We might just have to go after work some night. Let me know which ornament was your favorite. Munchkin loves reading comments, especially ones that are about her. Um, anyway, that's it for today's video. As always, I'm going to have my links down below for my Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, See if I use this. I definitely use Facebook all the time, Instagram sometimes, and Twitter almost never. Although I am trying, trying to tweet at least twice a day. Sometimes three times. We'll see what happens. Anyway, see you guys tomorrow. Bye.